Hi, welcome back to the PDF Element channel. My name's George. In today's video, we're gonna learn how to keep all of our PDFs synced between our devices in a very quick way. In this way, you'll be able to work on them anytime from any place without losing your progress. Welcome back to the PDF Element channel. Duplicating your PDF files and switching them between devices can be useful if you need to back up your progress. However, this is far from the most efficient way to be able to work on your PDFs from multiple devices. So what is the most efficient way to be able to work on PDFs from other devices? The best way to work with PDF files from other devices is using data synchronization technology. This way you'll be able to access and work on the same documents from any device anywhere in the world. Sounds good, right? In this video, I'm gonna show you how to sync your files across other devices using PDF Element. We're gonna go over these steps, connecting your PC, connecting your Mac, connecting your mobile, uploading files to the cloud, sharing and syncing your PDF files, and sharing PDFs with anyone else. Before we go any further, you need to make sure you've got PDF Element downloaded on your device. You can go get the download from the download link in the description below this video. To start syncing your PDF files between your devices, you'll first need to connect your devices to Document Cloud through PDF Element. Now, let's learn how to do it. Number one, connecting your PC. Once you've opened PDF Element, click on the login button on the top right corner of the window. Now a pop-up window will appear where you can log in or create a new account. If you don't have a Wondershare ID yet, click on the create account and fill in the form to create one. Otherwise, just click next. That's it, your PC is now connected. Let's see how to perform this process on Mac. Number two, connecting your Mac. Open the PDF Element app and click on the login button from the document cloud section or use the login button found in the top right corner of the window. Now log in with your Wondershare ID. Pretty simple, right? Now let's talk about the PDF Element mobile version. Number three, connecting your mobile. I'm going to show you this process on the iPhone, but don't worry if you've got an Android, it's a very similar process. Open the PDF Element app and tap on the user icon located in the top left corner of your screen. Now tap on the login button and log in with your Wondershare ID. Great, we finished connecting the devices. Now it's time to move on. Number four, uploading our files to the cloud. To start syncing your files, you first need to upload them to the document cloud. This will only take a few seconds and I'm gonna show you how to do it. Starting with PDF element for Windows, go to the document cloud section and click on the cloud button in the upper right corner of the window. Now in Windows, you will see a window where you will have to confirm the name we want to assign to the document in the cloud. When your documents are ready, you should see them in the document cloud section. On Mac, this might be even simpler. Once you're in the document cloud section, you'll only need to drag and drop your documents inside the window. Just like the Windows version, once the documents are uploaded, you should see them in the document cloud section. Now you'll need to repeat this process with all the documents that you want to sync. Don't worry about the size or the format of the files because the document cloud feature provides you with one gigabyte of free storage and it's completely free to use. Number five, sharing and syncing our PDF files. Now your documents are in the cloud and all you need to do to be able to share and sync those files is to log in with your Wondershare ID on other devices. Please note that the free version document cloud will allow you to share your documents with up to five users per day. In most cases, this will not be a problem. Now let me show you how document synchronization works using document cloud. I'm first going to access from a Windows computer the document I just uploaded to the cloud. I'm now going to add a quick stamp to the document using PDF elements editing tools. Now I'll save the changes by clicking on the save button in the top left corner and then I'll click on continue trial because we also provide a trial version for you to try this share and sync feature. Now from a Mac, I'll open the same document from the document cloud. As you can see, the document already shows the modifications I made earlier. Now I'm just going to make one more change. I'll add another stamp using PDF elements markup tools and now I'll save the changes by going to the file and select the document cloud option in the share sub menu here. Now using PDF element for iOS, I'll open this document once again. As you can see, the document is already updated and that was it. As you can see, sharing documents with document cloud across other devices is extremely easy. But then is it strictly necessary to use PDF element in order to share these files? The answer is no. You can also create shareable links so that anyone can view the document you'd like to show them. Let me explain. Number six, share PDF files with anyone else. We're on to the most important part. As long as your files are stored in Wondershare Document Cloud, PDF Element allows you to generate links so you can share them with anyone on the web. Now I'm gonna show you how to generate one of these links. On Windows, you'll first need to open the document you want to share from the Document Cloud section within PDF Element. Once this is done, click on the share button located on the upper right corner of the window. Now a pop-up window will appear where you can see the automatically generated link. Simply click on the copy link button and share the link with whoever you want. Please notice this link is valid for 30 days and please make sure you give this key information to your recipient while you share the link. On Mac, 
You can generate shareable links from the list of documents in the document cloud section. Simply click on the three dots button and select the create shareable link option and share the link with whoever you want. I'm sure that many times before you've had to share PDF files through emails or through removable hardware like a USB stick. The problem is that these methods have limitations and other problems that come with them. But if we sync our documents, it becomes much more useful as it avoids having to update your documents and then resend them or resave them. Every time you make changes, those changes are visible on any device with access. And that's why you watch this video. Thank you so much for watching this video. Did you see just how simple it was to be able to share your PDF files? I'm pretty sure that from now on, you're only ever going to use this feature to sync your PDFs between your desktop, your mobile devices, and with any other people. Whatever the case might be, I hope you get the most out of using this great tool. Don't forget to check out the rest of the content on our channel, like our videos on how to share PDFs between Mac and PC, or how to transfer PDF files from a Mac to an iPhone or an iPad. If you like this video, please drop a like down below and subscribe to the channel, and we'll see you in the next video.